Yes, that's right. As a new bike, the last purchase was a mistake, unfortunately. But we live and learn. Anyway, without further ado, let's do the unveiling and see what we've got in store. Yeah, that's right. I bought a BMW. You're not a proper rider unless you've got a BMW. This is a G310, so it's a 310cc single cylinder. It's uh, second hand, but um, we bought it with only 600 kilometres on the, on the um, speedo. So, it's a lovely looking thing. And you've got to love gold forks. Beautiful. And as you can see, it fits me perfectly. Easily put my feet on the ground. It weighs a hundred kilos less than the Africa Twin. It's so light and maneuverable. Anyway, that's enough of this silliness. Obviously, I'm not replacing my Africa Twin, which I absolutely love. The BMW is Wendy's new bike. Wendy's done about 12,000 kilometres on the Vulcan. But the feet forward riding position and the short, reasonably harsh suspension is not doing her body any favours. We're both getting old, but neither of us want to give up our bikes yet. So, it's the new BMW for Wendy with much plusher suspension and a better upright sitting position. The BMW only puts out 34 horsepower, but it's amazing how well it gets along on the road. And of course, it handles and corners really nicely. It has a reasonably low seat height, but we still had to lower it another 40 millimetres for Wendy to get her feet flat on the ground and feel confident. While Wendy loves the power of the Vulcan, it's 60 kilos heavier than the BMW, so the BM's a lot easier to handle when stopped and manoeuvring, etc. And the suspension is much more plush. Wendy describes it as like riding on a magic carpet ride compared to the Vulcan. So this is the new bike and hopefully a couple more years of riding to come.